YouTube, welcome back to the channel. My name is Cool Whip, and we are bringing you in an entirely new series. Not only do we have a wonderful gun to showcase for you today that was recommended by one of our viewers, like we typically do on the channel, but kind of in the background, we're going to start an entire new series. It's going to be the Modern Warfare Zombies reboot. We are deleting all of these wonderful items from our stash, and yes, this is incredibly painful. The rules are pretty simple. We can only craft something if we extracted with that schematic during this series. So that that's pretty much it. There will be a spreadsheet linked in the description for you to kind of follow along with what schematics we've unlocked and what we still have. But yeah, without further ado, let's get to the gameplay. First, a quick word from this video's sponsor, Messy Modding. From unlocking Interstellar or Borealis Camo, pre-made accounts, bot lobbies, nuke services, schematics, and more. Tons of verified reviews on Trustpilot. If unlocked services are your thing, check them out. Link is in the description. Back to the video. So yeah, you got it. The rules are pretty simple. We are going to be spawning with the AMR9. This one was recommended by Chris Smith's 3763. He had a very specific build for us to use so we're going to use it i'm going to go ahead and throw that build up on screen for you here now and we're gonna kick this off i guess with a cargo delivery because we don't really have anything so let's go i wonder if we can hurry up and grab speed cola without this helicopter destroying our vehicle what are the odds out of 10 oh we're gonna give it a shot because you know what's the worst thing that can happen they destroy our vehicle and we don't get our, what, 2,500 essence for a tier one contract? All right, we got our speed cola and, okay, half damage, not bad. I will take it. If that'll get us started off. We'll definitely at least get a self revive out of here. Hopefully a perk or something else. Let's see. Oh, a wonder waff. Um, I don't even know if I want it. I'm not a wonder waff. Ah, oh, we'll take it. We'll take it. Whatever. We'll take it. All right, what do we have next? All right, sport control seems pretty good to me. Let's do that. I'm going to go ahead and leave my truck here because I think when we finish with this sport control, we're going to go ahead and get some death perception for free because why not? And if you don't know how to do it, well, you're about to learn here as soon as this contract is over. We are well over 1600 subscribers into this YouTube channel. So thank each and every one of you who have liked the video, sub to the channel, everybody with the notifications on. And if you haven't done so already, hey, please do so. If you're enjoying the content, let me know. Drop that like on it. Hit that sub button, turn on those notifications, help us continue to grow. If you haven't joined our Discord community yet, that is a very fast growing community down there as well. They are very active. Everybody's always talking to one another, finding people to play with inside a game. And it's a great way to stay up to date with everything that I have going on with the channel. So yeah, we'd love to have you as a part of the community if you are interested. That link's in the description. We're going to go ahead and get all of these inhibitors thrown. Where is this one? Oh, is it below us? Yeah, it's below us. Okay. And everything's just so different. I haven't done any of these tier one contracts like this in so long. Just very sporadically. One here, one there. But just not, not terribly often, anyway. So with the conversion kit that was recommended here to us, it has, like, the double barrel. Kind of like the, uh, I think it's the Holger that also has, like, a double barrel. So, yeah, you get to fire two bullets with every time you pull the trigger. So we'll kind of see how this gun works here throughout the game. But we need to go ahead and get the rest of these spores finished up here. Okay, that'll do it for that. Let's see what we got in this one. The reload is kind of slow with this gun. Some tombstone. We will take it. Now we're going to climb this tower. Where is this tower? Where, where am I? Oh, okay, right behind us. All right, we're going to climb up to the top of that tower. I'll see you when we get there. Okay, we made it to the top. What have we got in here? Anything? Ooh, a medium rucksack. Very nice. I will take that. So to get the free death perception, you're going to want to climb up on this railing, kind of do like the dive jump and start floating off toward these three rings right here. Very simple. Try to keep yourself as high in the air as you can. You're going to want to slow down just a little bit as you approach and then speed up and turn. You're going to try not to hit any of them and just kind of turn through them. And you do that and this porter will spawn here and you get some free death perception. So... I mean, I know there's plenty of guides out there for it, but hey, some of you may not have known that. This might be the first zombies video that, that you've ever watched. I don't know. Hopefully you got some enjoyment out of it. I'm going to head over to the Pack-a-Punch. Hey, now I've been asked a few times in the comments, all you have to do is melee the Pack-a-Punch machine before you apply your crystal or purchase the Pack-a-Punch and you'll keep your camo. It's that simple. As long as you don't melee it again, anytime you upgrade from there, you will keep your camo. If you do melee the machine again, then it will replace your camo if you were to apply a crystal or buy another pack of punch after that. So yeah, just do it one time per game if you want to keep your camo. Yeah, that's that. Um, I think maybe we could try to do something in the tier two zone. Let's try. 
servers are so wonky. <laughs> a three plate fest, very nice. Yeah, the, uh, there's so much packet burst. I'm just like bouncing all over the screen. This is absolutely terrible. I just wanted to loot these lockers before I went off to that bounty. Oh my word. I hope I hope we don't crash. Please don't crash. All right, we finally made it over to this disciple and it is becoming completely evident to me very quickly that we are very undergunned. Oh no. Oh, this, this could take some time. All right, let's see if our energy mine here can help us out a little bit. We're able to deal with the zombies okay. We're, I mean, we did a little bit of damage. And I would like to, that was probably, that was probably the energy mine that really helped us out there. No, no, we did some damage there. I guess as long as we're hitting some criticals. I feel like we're going through ammo though pretty quickly. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting close. Oh my gosh, he's healing so much so fast. All right, I'm gonna need to, I can't, I can't, I'm trying to shoot the wand and I can't shoot the wand. All right, hopefully we can use this building maybe to our advantage a little bit and try to, try to stay out of his, he, oh no, come on, Mimic. No, Mimic, go away, Mimic, go away. I. Right, oh, please go away. Oh no, we're out of ammo, no, 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 come on, reload, reload. Oh gosh, all right. Oh, we're down to just 170 rounds. I. Come on, we can finish. Oh, where are you going? Get back here. Get back here and fight like a man. Fight like a man. Where, where are you going? Oh, come on. No, come on. 14 rounds. No. No, no, no. Can we finish him with the Wonder Wolf? Oh, he's healing off of us again. Come on. No, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I can't even get the reloads off with the Wonder Wolf. Oh, we're not getting, we're not getting anywhere. Oh yeah, this is, I, I can't stop him from healing. Oh, oh, where did he come from? Really? I ran all the way over to this ether nest because I didn't realize it was an ether nest. I just saw the ammo cache and I can't even get in there to get the ammo. So I guess I just had to drive 300 meters to this ammo cache. Okay, let's go back to the bounty now. Come on, Cole Whip, you're so close, buddy. This, this fight took so long. I don't know how long this took, but oh my gosh, it took so long. It took so incredibly long. However, on, oh my, on the bright side, we did get a uh, blue ether tool. So, okay, maybe now we can do another bounty since we have the blue tool. Oh, this was such a mistake. The, the blue tool pack one is not even enough and we are out of ammo again. Oh, come on, no. These disciples are absolute bullet sponges. So are some of these zombies. Oh, this is this can be frustrating. The you think you have 200 rounds, but it go, it goes so quick because you you really only have 100 fires of the trigger because it's it's like having double tap. So yeah, it goes it goes pretty quick. A lot of our problem right now is just being under gunned right now. Pack a punch one in purple. Where are you going? Oh, he is going back and he's healing. Oh, this is, we are off to such a terrible, terrible start in this game. We've probably wasted 15 minutes fighting two bounty disciples. At least 15 minutes. No, oh, I just wanted to refill my ammo. I, I'm guessing a cargo delivery spawned, of course. Well, we might as well go grab it, I suppose. All right, we are almost there. Oh no, it's down there. No, oh my gosh. Uh, all right, all right, I'll back up. Oh my word. All right, cargo delivery and nothing is really going our way this game. <laughs> nothing is going our way at all. We do have enough to pack a punch too though, so let's go do that. All right, let's go. Beautiful. Nothing in here. Oh, green tool. Okay, I'll stow that since, cause yeah, we don't have anything. So that might come in handy next game. So with this Outlast contract, at least we are finally able to start doing some real damage to some zombies. Hopefully we'll get lucky and at least get an epic tool so we can really kind of see what this gun's made of. There's only 17 minutes left in this match, though. We'll take a couple of perks, though. All right. So, Disciple, I don't I don't have the energy. Okay, there is a cargo delivery. I doubt we can make it over there. There's a lot of people in the zone, but we're going to try. But yeah, I definitely did not have the energy to fight another Disciple. I mean, y'all watched what happened last time. I don't care if that one was a bounty or not. Just ain't got the energy. 
I mean, of course we didn't get that. I am going to head over to this bounty though, because I have a turret circuit and maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, let's go. Yes. Come on. Let's go. But I'm hoping if I get that bounty. <laughs> oh, sorry. I get distracted squirrel. Uh, but yeah, hopefully if we get that bounty, it'll spawn near a turret circuit. And we can take it out relatively easily because we need some essence really fast. There's only 15 minutes left in this match, so... Hopefully we can get over there to it, but oh, there is an outlast here. So let's just do that instead while we're, we're running circles with zombies. Why not? Let's do it. I think we can handle it, right? We can handle it. I hope we can handle it. No, no, no. Don't get me. Don't get me. Leave me alone. No, I threw a decoy. What are you doing? I threw a decoy. I think we're going to need that self revive for sure. Things are getting dicey. This this might have been a mistake. We might not have been ready for this. We're we're not really taking them out too well. That doesn't give me a whole lot of high hopes for this gun because once we get to pack three, usually once they're at pack a punch two in purple, they are at least killing them a little bit better than this. Now, granted, we don't have dead shot or anything either, but let's use our energy mon and hopefully that that did not take out very many of them. Oh no no no. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. I need everybody to look away from the screen right now. Just just don't watch. I'm, I'm definitely going to go down here. There's zero chance we don't go down. Oh, another little decoy. Let's get him off of me. No, why are you still... I, where did my decoy go? Why is it not working? Oh, my word. All right, please, please don't hit me again. We also don't have Juggernaut. You really? Oh, come on. No way. But yeah, without Juggernaut, you're like a one slap down when you ain't got no plates. And now we ain't got no self revives. Uh oh, this this could be trouble. Well, at least we got this finished. We'll get the 5000, but it's just going to get wasted on a self revive. Uh, a pack of punch one cursed. I, I don't have time to go back for it. They'll they'll kill me for sure. All right, let's go buy a selfie. Okay, selfie purchase. We picked up a bounty and I'm going to put this turret circuit in and we're going to try to lure him all the way up here. Hopefully we can get him up here in, in range of our turret circuit so we can take him out for the essence. Oh, I'll take that. Thank you. I, I don't know if you actually wanted to get rid of that. We're still trying to coax this guy up here. Oh, two free self revives. Let's go. Oh, we needed those so bad. All right, come on. Let's get this guy up here and in range. Come on, there you go. Come up the side here. Now, is that gonna is that gonna do it? Yes, let's go. All right. Let me get him taken out here. Man, it, it kind of makes it look like my gun is just chewing through him here. Heck, maybe it is. I don't know. Turret circuit is <laughs> doing some work though. Let's go. All right, hit a couple criticals. Man, when we hit some criticals in addition to the turret circuit, they really just kind of. It really just speeds things along, doesn't it? Golly, there he goes. Let's grab that essence. Oh, he tried to take our essence. It's probably because we tried to take his tool. All right, a sentry gun. Finally, some juggernaut. Let's go. Another selfie can never go wrong. All right, another bounty up here. Any chance we can get it? Ah, uh, there's already somebody going for it, so that'll be a negative. He still hasn't picked it up yet. Maybe I'll just join squad with it. Maybe he'll let us join up. Oh, okay. Well, whatever then. I'll just take it. I don't know where they want to be that person, but I don't know why you're just standing there staring at it. Okay, sweet. Uh, a mega abomination. We don't have any more turret circuits, but we do have a sentry gun. That could definitely help us out here. We get this one and we'll be able to pack a punch three. Okay, sentry gun down. Right there. All right, now let's start doing some damage on this mega. Hopefully our sentry gun really helps us out. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Right now it is. All right, let's go laser attack. Okay, we got him like halfway now. This is this is good. We got this. We got this. All right, I told you we had it. No problem. Not a problem at all. Oh, a cargo delivery. Yeah, no chance. They're definitely grabbing that. Okay, we have enough to go pack three now. And of course, we got to run across the entire map. And finally, with six minutes to go, we get to pack three. What? <laughs> Hopefully we can do something in six minutes. I think that some players were going to do the worm. I saw them talking about it. Somebody said they had all the USBs. 
So hopefully if they're doing it, we'll join. But maybe we can get this bounty over here. Oh no, this guy's going for it too. Oh, I hate when I'm stuck on foot. And you saw me, del where did, oh, he didn't go for it. He, oh, there's so many zombies here. No, don't go down, Good, don't go down. Oh, geez, okay, what do we got? Give me something quick. Oh, a mangler, we'll take a mangler. Okay, now, we are at what I would test all of these guns at. We're at purple pack three. This is where we do all of our gun testing. So we'll get to finally see, is this AMR9 any good? Oh, that's that's not bad. Wow, this thing really takes a giant leap forward once you get to pack three. Let's go. Yes. Oh, yeah. We just, we deleted that horde. That's, that's amazing. That is amazing. All right, we did grab some dead shot on our way here. So let's see what kind of damage we can do to this mangler. My energy mine's helping out a little bit there. Like I'm not, I'm not hitting my shots very well here. But there's, there's not much room to work right here. <laughs> oh no, not a mimic. Now we got a mimic too. All right, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to get out of here and get a little bit of separation here to try to get this done. Oh no, I thought I was shooting a mimic, and then the mangler started blocking bullets. Ah, oh, it's, come on. Come on, come on, Cool Whip. You got this. You got this. You can do it. You can do it, Cool Whip. You can do it. Kick his ass. Let's go. All right, come on. Come on. Get him. Let's go. Oh, we're out of ammo. No, no, no. Don't, don't go down. Don't go down. Yeah, shred through that armored zombie. Let's go. Oh, yeah. This is good. All right, Mimic. No so close come on we are so close okay that mimic's gone all right let's finish off this mangler i don't know why he decided to not follow us out here i mean i appreciate it because he wasn't really getting in the way oh out of ammo again okay one more shot there we go anything good no another self-revive but of course we will take that Okay, so I'm out here near the worm fight and I don't see anybody coming. I think, I think we were lied to everybody. Nobody is coming for the worm fight. So I guess it is just time to exfil. And while we have a little bit of extra fun here with this AMR9, which we might bring this into another game. We have a purple tool. We can bring it in and really give this gun a good test out. But I do appreciate the suggestion. If any of you have suggestions, that any guns you'd like us to try, especially on this series, go ahead and drop those down in the comment section down below. Be happy to try out even any special challenges, anything you want to see on this series. This is going to be episode one. Like I said, we didn't get any schematics here, so we can't craft anything when we come back for episode two. But we do get a few items to take for our backpack. But that's going to do it. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a like, hit the sub button, turn on those notifications. YouTube thinks that you might enjoy one of these videos here. We got our operator up to level 22 and a couple items for next match. So I will see you in the next episode. My name is Cole Whip and I'm out.